Charles Robert Darwin was born on February 12, 1809, in Shrewsbury, Shropshire, England. His father, Robert Waring Darwin, was a wealthy society doctor and financier. His mother, Susanna, came from the prominent Wedgwood family, famous for their pottery business. She died when Charles was eight years old. Charles was the fifth of six children. At the age of nine, Darwin was sent to the Shrewsbury School, a boarding school. In 1825, Darwin was sent to the University of Edinburgh to study medicine. In 1828, his father sent him to Christ's College, Cambridge, to study for a Bachelor of Arts degree, intending for him to become a clergyman. At Cambridge, Darwin was influenced by botanist John Stevens Henslow and geologist Adam Sedgwick. In 1831, Darwin was offered a position as a naturalist on the HMS Beagle, a survey ship set to chart the coast of South America. The voyage lasted from 1831 to 1836 and provided Darwin with invaluable experience and a vast collection of specimens. During the voyage, Darwin visited the Galapagos Islands, where he observed variations in species from island to island. These observations were crucial in developing his theory of natural selection. After returning to England, Darwin settled in London and began working on his collections and notes from the Beagle Voyage. In 1839, Darwin married his cousin, Emma Wedgwood. They had ten children, though some suffered from health problems, which concerned Darwin and influenced his views on hereditary conditions. Darwin published On the Origin of Species in 1859. The book presented his evidence and arguments for evolution by natural selection, fundamentally changing the understanding of biological diversity. In 1871, Darwin published The Descent of Man, in which he applied his evolutionary theory to human evolution, suggesting that humans and apes share a common ancestor. Darwin's theory of natural selection provided a mechanism for evolution, explaining how species adapt and change over time based on environmental pressures. Throughout his life, Darwin suffered from various health issues. Despite these challenges, he remained dedicated to his work. Charles Darwin died on April 19, 1882, at his home in Down House, Kent. He was buried in Westminster Abbey, an honor reflecting his significant contributions to science. Darwin's work laid the foundation for modern evolutionary biology. His contributions continue to inspire scientific inquiry and discovery.